What's going on, my PT peeps? My walking dead family, my fighters. I'm One Eye Bry, also known as PT. You don't know if I'm winking or blinking, but I'm definitely thinking about this person on Instagram messaging me this morning, June 25th, 2022. We're going to talk about it. Is it him and the drama that's still going on? But um, yeah, I'm not going to mention the person's name except for in the comments when this person wrote it in text. So that's just how I'm going to mention, you know, who I'm talking about from my previous videos. But ultimately, guys, it's been a crazy week. So I woke up Wednesday morning, checked the comments because I respond to comments. I like to have people talk and interact with them and just, you know, be a part of the channel. And there was a bunch of different comments going around about subs from this channel, that channel, this channel dropped subs, that channel gained subs. This was up, this was down. And then hashtag unsub from the PT channel. Hashtag unsub, hashtag unsub. And I'm like, what's going on here? And if you want to find out more, check out the video with this thumbnail of Dale Face, Dale Face. And um, you can find out more. So I wake up Saturday morning and I get this message from this person on Instagram. And it's on my Norman Reedus photo, or it was, because the person's been blocked and restricted. But after this comment, it's just pretty ridiculous. And they said they sent me a direct message and they suggest I read it. So it was like a, a threat, basically, almost. So I go to my direct messages, and there's this message here from Biscuitman92. Zero followers, zero posts, no you know, photo, and it's a new account. New Instagram account. It says it right here. You don't follow each other, but this person follows me. They follow me today. So today, at 5.16 in the morning. So I would have guessed it's across the pond, unless this person's up at 5.16 in the morning. Brian, I have been following this debacle between you and George Drake this last week, and I now feel I need to comment. What you're doing to the guy is vile. If you have a problem, you should deal with it in private. What you're actually doing is rounding up your hounds to attack him. Actually, I'm not. I've never said anyone to attack him. This is what this person has actually done to me and other people. And you can see comments, what people wrote, that this person allegedly has done it to other people. I thought so much better of you. And to see you go out with hardly any information and try to ruin his reputation made me feel ill. I'm not trying to ruin anything. I'm just going what's going on my channel and my viewpoint of things, which I'm allowed to do, right? And I'm allowed to respond, right? Am I, am I not allowed to do that? You're just a bully hiding behind your screen. I don't see him attacking you. Okay, I'm not a bully at all. I'm responding to stuff. I've never come after him or went after him. It's been the other way around. And that's what people do sometimes. I have a minor in psychology. I kind of know what people justify things by saying, well, he's attacking me. He's doing this, so I'm right. I'm sticking for myself. That's the other way around. Don't try to blame me. I'm the victim here. But people do what people do. I used to follow you. And the ironic thing is, I have now unscribed from you because of your conduct. I stand with George on this, as do many of your followers, I imagine. I suggest you learn from your disastrous mistakes here and grow up. Exclamation point. Exclamation point. Great. I'll assume you'll be removing all associated videos and posts today. 6-25-2022. I have so many more things to say to you, but I'm so angry at this right now. I see from your past videos that you have a wife. I wonder if she knows what you're doing. Yes, I've talked to her and she's fine with it because I'm sticking up for myself and I'm not attacking anyone. And I grew up doing martial arts. And there's a mindset that don't attack, don't be the aggressor, unless you're Cobra Kai, right? But don't go after people, but defend yourself. Stick up for yourself. And that's what I'm doing here. One last thing, ethically, <laughs> unless you don't remove all the videos and posts on this matter, I think you should consider retiring your YouTube account. Thank you, Biscuitman92. And thank you for your point of view and your thoughts. And just the name Biscuitman92 makes me think of this person in a certain part of the globe, right? So I just think that this person could be the person from the YouTube channel with a different account because when I talk to the person that is this drama is about on Instagram, not YouTube, by the way, staying away from the platform, you're going here because you have plausible deniability. It's not me. It's not me. And the person has said time and time again, it's not them because if it's a different account, you can say it's that person or it's a troll. Why do you care so much what people are saying? Why do you care so much in the comments? You know, I'm just sticking up for myself. You know, I care about my channel. I care about my subscribers. I care about my patrons, my members. And that's just what it comes down to. But this has happened before. This is at least the third time where the person reached out to me on Instagram, sent some messages, and then we talked, settled it, 
some stuff happened again. Other people are instant messaging me or on Facebook and Instagram. Similar stuff too, like the dialogue has been the same, the word choice has been the same, and it just makes you wonder about, is this the person behind the channel or someone connecting with them? Because you could make a bunch of different usernames, a bunch of different channel names, a bunch of different stuff, and increase your numbers that way, or come at people that way. Just hide behind different names. It's not me, it's this person. Plausible deniability. But it's just a shame that this is happening. And I don't know what people say on other channels and what they do, but I'm trying to control my narrative and what's happening to me with facts, proof, stuff here, and messages there too. And I can't really share the direct messages from the person on the other YouTube channel because they're gone now, restricted, blocked, whatever. And then I get the message from this person a day later or two days later after that. And I'm just being transparent to control the narrative because I don't know what's being said out there, but Either way, guys, thank you for the love and support. It means the world to me. Stay safe, and as always, tell them, Daryl. Yeah, we love you guys. Honestly, thank you.